Well, welcome everybody. Uh, here we are after a little bit of a hiatus back with our partner showcase series. And today on Thanksgiving Eve, I'm delighted to have here with me Arun Rajasekaran from Edge Impulse. And we're going to spend a few minutes, maybe six, seven minutes talking a little bit about what is Edge Impulse and what is Arun up to these days. So Arun, welcome. Thanks for joining me. Hey, Miguel. Uh, thanks for having me on. Fantastic. So what is Edge Impulse? Tell us a little bit about your company and tell us about your, your role over there. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, if any of you celebrate Thanksgiving, uh, and I have happy Thanksgiving. Um, Edge Impulse is a relatively new you know, player in, in the ML space. Uh, so we are a little more than two years old, uh, maybe three, approaching three years. So we are effectively a Edge ML platform. So that's, that's, uh, that's what we do. And to go a little deeper... So it's a SaaS platform, uh, system, you know, software as a service platform, which is meant for designing, developing, testing, and building edge machine learning models, and allowing you to deploy and maintain it. Uh, so it's it's a uh, edge ML in general. It's a it's a new field, and uh, we are one of the leading players. Uh, so it's a platform that uh, many customers use us to develop edge ML inference models. And Edge ML or Edge Machine Learning is an interesting mm -hmm. and explosive space to be in. So yeah. specifically at Edge Impulse, as you embrace this Edge ML machine learning space, what, what are the, the key areas of focus for you right now? Yeah, uh, so it, it, is a, it has been a transformation that has been happening the last few years. Um, you know, with IoT, you know, as all of you know, that has been a slow transformation. Things becoming connected. IoT is a very, very uh, key relevant technology on which Edge ML is being built on. And now on top of IoT, Edge Compute has been coming into play, which is in you know, a more powerful computational capabilities right at the edge. So all these are very, very uh, key precursors to machine learning revolution that we are in the middle of, early stages of, but still it's uh, pretty, pretty aggressive. So um, uh, two, two key focus areas, and it's, it's a platform, like I mentioned earlier, in theory, any machine learning uh, capabilities needed for the endpoint can be done using the Edge Impulse platform. But as with any business, you have to have a focus uh, area areas and we are focusing on two specific uh, opportunities. One is around human health devices that focus on human health and other is around machine health devices that focus on knowing the health of machines. So those are our two uh, focus areas as of now. And it's interesting because it kind of uh, fits nicely as well with the areas of focus for Valer Systems because we exactly. have a big, big part of our focus is around uh, medical devices, whether mm -hmm. wearables or not, but also IoT, Internet of Things, and smart cities, smart cars, exactly. smart buildings. So there's that. I can see how your human health and your machine health fits in nicely with our approach as well. And just to go today, just a little bit of a teaser, perhaps we'll do mm -hmm. a webinar mm -hmm. together in the future. But Arun, going just a little bit, for instance, into the uh, human health side, can you just elaborate a little bit more about that side? Yeah, sure. Uh, so one of our early uh, customers have been Aura, right? You know, the ring I'm wearing, and oh, you really? might have seen an ad or two. So it it became uh, uh, probably, you know, it's a no-brainer now looking back because there are so many bio signals the human body emanates, and uh, you know, and machine learning capability kind of became a perfect marriage because machine learning at the edge really relies on signals. You know, wherever the signals are coming from. And, and uh, there are bio signals that human body emanates. Uh, speech is a signal, uh, temperature is a signal, ECG, PPG. There's a whole slew of you know, sensors that have been maturing and getting miniaturized over the years, which have been accurately measuring these signals from the human body. And now, you know, just asking the general population to decode seeing a signal uh, is not uh, that smart. So machine learning makes it so simple to extract the insights from the signal. So Aura's magic is your sleep quality. So there are so many companies now that are trying to figure out how to use the signals that human body is emanating by, by having a wearable that has a sensor or sensors. You know, if you are a, a Apple Watch a fan, then it has so many signal, so many sensors already embedded into that wearable, which gives you the insights into how many steps you are taking, you know, along your fitness and whatnot. But there are tens, literally, in some cases, um, even more number of uh, interesting insights about your health 
uh, that these variables in the human health space that are uh, going to come out in the in the next uh, few months and years. It's an exciting space, and I know yeah. today we we could go and talk for an hour about the exactly. machine health piece, the the human health piece. But today we just wanted to have a few minutes with you, and and I I'm really excited about this partnership between Valer Systems with our hardware and firmware focus as we build help organizations build their devices and develop pro mm -hmm. prototypes partnering with you guys as you bring in this edge and this new entire ecosystem, machine learning uh, algorithms and intelligence and data into the fore. So That's I great. really appreciate uh, this time. Uh, just one day before Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. I want to say thank you to you, Arun. Yeah. And I um, uh, want to wish everybody a happy Thanksgiving. Yeah, and, happy Thanksgiving. Uh, yes. And let's... Uh, uh, keep in touch and stay mm -hmm. tuned for the next episode of our Partner Showcase series. Thanks yeah. again. Thank you. Thanks, Miguel, for having me.